Hello everybody, in this video, I'm going to give an update on my portfolio. Right now, my portfolio is worth $87,276.50. Today, I was down $1,484.05. And then after hours, I am up $692.03. Let's go over my positions. I'm selling Amazon $185 covered calls. These expire on April 19th. My total return is $210. I'm selling Disney $120 covered calls. These expire April 19th. My total return, I am down $465. I'm selling Google $145 covered call. This expires April 19. My total return, I am down $639. I'm selling LUV $30 covered calls. These expire April 19. My total return, $75. I'm selling PayPal $60 covered calls. These expire April 19. My total return, I am down $506. I'm selling SoFi $9 covered calls. These expire April 19. My total return, $1,200. I'm selling Verizon $42 covered calls. These expire April 19. My total return $102. For my stocks, I have 300 shares of Amazon. Amazon is at $179.24. My average cost $98.95. Total return $24,000. $90.65 I have 6,000 shares of SoFi SoFi is at $7.25 My average cost $5.62 Total return $9,760.80 I have 300 shares of Disney Disney is at $120 my average cost, $60. Total return, $18,000. I have 100 shares of Google. Google is at $151.10. My average cost, $142.48. My total return, $862. I have 500 shares of LUV. LUV is at $28.44. My average cost, $28.03. Total return, $205. I have 200 shares of PayPal. PayPal is at $67.15. My average cost, $57.70. Total return, $1,890. I have 200 shares of Verizon. Verizon is at $40.95. My average cost, $39.31. Total return, $328.10. I have $3,973.13 of buying power. That's pretty much it. Nothing new happened in my portfolio. I did take a look at maybe changing some of my strike prices for my covered calls, but I didn't really pull the trigger today. All my positions are still the same from my last update, so nothing really new happened. Well, there was something new that happened today, but it's not really part of my portfolio. It's the announcement of the Robinhood Gold credit card which I did put myself on the waitlist for. However, I think I'll talk about that in a separate video. But that's pretty much it for this portfolio update. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. 
and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you.